says whitewater rafting has to happen in the mountains of Colorado. Why not in Austin, Minnesota? That sounds pretty good to me. And that's what some city leaders are saying as they're looking to replace its 100-year-old dam system with a new tourist destination that I think you're mm -hmm. going to be excited about because we are. Our Darian Letty actually met up with the group and uh, she was learning more about this. So Darian, tell us about the project. Yeah, Justin Kelsey, really interesting. It's actually kind of the brainchild of a resident of Austin. His name is Nathan Smith. He came up with the idea when he was kayaking and fishing on the Cedar River, but he kept running into dams along his way. He started to look at the map of the river that travels all the way into Iowa, and he noticed that the water in Charles City, Iowa, looked a little different. Well, it was because there was a whitewater park here. Here's some video of it right here. It's the first of its kind in Iowa. After he saw this, Smith wanted to bring that idea to Austin, which would also be the first in Minnesota. The goal is to repurpose the old dam with five rapid pools, all while retaining the same surface water elevation. To create the rapids, crews would build drops. The first three above the dam, another at the actual dam, and the final one just downstream. Here's a look at the map of what the park would look like. You can see those drops kind of start over by the YMCA and have a few more of those going downstream. Project leaders say if built, this would be a free attraction for people of all income levels, abilities, and interests. We're a river city and it's time we embrace it, so it would allow us to embrace that identity. Also, it would help uh, bring more tourists and vibrancy to this part of the downtown, which is exciting. We already have the number one tourist uh, destination in this area, the Spam Museum. And so can you imagine going to the Spam Museum and then going whitewater rafting? It's just pretty cool. Spam Museum and whitewater rafting, that's a fun itinerary right there. Most recently, the city of Austin completed a feasibility study on this project. Researchers found it was possible to make this happen with a price tag of $10 million. Right now, project and city leaders are looking to secure some funding through the state and federal grants, as well as funding from the Hormel Foundation right there in Austin. So once funding is secured and they get these permits, they're hoping that this will take about six months to a year to complete and they're looking for 20, uh, to do it in 2026. Okay. I think this is a pretty cool project, you guys. This dam, it is over 100 years old. Right. It actually needs to be replaced anyways, so the leaders thought, why not make something new of it? Let's be imaginative and do something fun for the community. Oh my gosh, this is just so cool. It has me excited for summers. Yes, yes, <laughs> it, it has something to look forward to. It will yeah. get warmer. We will be able to do this again one day. <laughs> that's that's what we need this morning. A little, a little inspiration and something to look forward to. Thank you, Darian. Thanks, guys.